Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Finally, you woke up. <laughs> Finally. Oh, man. Well, I've been so enthralled. I've never uh, talked to somebody who's developed an app before. So <laughs> we are back with Check It app developer Jonathan Avalos. Have I been saying that correctly? Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Sometimes Close. Close. Uh, no, yeah. Before we went to break, we were talking about uh, how you, you went to an outside uh, developer to develop your app. Mm-hmm. Um, Outsource. You, so you outsourced the development of it. Do you have other ideas? I mean, this seems like it's going to be a success. I think it's a, a great idea. Do you have ideas for, for future apps as well to kind of piggyback on this? Yeah. So, you know, our, my company's name is Relentless Ambitions. Um, Relentless you know, Ambitions? Relentless okay. Ambitions. So, uh, you know, we're not a single-minded company. You know, we're already looking, you know, a couple years in the future. So, yeah, um, yeah we have a few uh, new projects that we have, like, on standby you know obviously we want to push this out and get this rolling but uh we have yeah a couple new projects that you know we're willing to take a chance on you know because that's what that's what all this is you know it's it's not a guarantee it's all a chance and you know Uh, to some degree to some degree yeah Yeah, you have to you know not everybody will jump on what you think but uh, exactly if you are i think that you're in the perfect position with uh with a new in your generation. life yeah. to kind of take, you know, you're just about to be out of college. Mm-hmm. If you're going to take a risk and try something new, now is the time to get that out yeah. of the way. Yeah. And I mean, yeah. that's, that's the, basically the conclusion I came up with, you know, with my parents and mm-hmm. my friends and family. Um, you yeah. know, I, 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 if I wanted to do this, you know, let's say a couple years later, like uh-huh. chances are either somebody would have, you know, probably came up with it mm-hmm. or just, it just wouldn't have been relevant at yeah. the time. So it was either now or never, you know, and I, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm just an overall entrepreneur, you know, like I always have that vision of, you know, like what to create next or this and that. And, um, and this was just one of those things that would have honestly probably ended up in the back of my mind yeah. that I just never, you know. Mm-hmm. Did you have uh, some support from your professors or the people that you're in the school or how did you get it to, to the launch uh, stage? Yeah. So honestly, like if there was one word to describe it, it was just chaos, you know, <laughs> from, from, from where it was, you know, in the idea stage yeah. to now. Yeah. Um, I, I had a professor actually who was a class I missed today. So oh hopefully boy. she forgives me. Uh, professor Skelnick. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, honestly, she, she was the one I originally, um, approached with the idea. Today's about, uh, uh Veterans oh, Day. Oh, my school doesn't uh, practice is it? any. Well, no, I mean, it's not. no, it's not. A couple not. days ago. A couple okay. days ago was Veterans Day. Uh, okay. No, yeah. My so school n- doesn't schools are off. You're, oh, your school's a Christian no, yeah. school. We yeah. doesn't we recognize don't anything. recognize any kind of <laughs> any. holidays. Okay, whoa. No fun. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, um, she, you know, she told me to, you know, to kind of, she, she gave me kind of like the right direction to kind of approach it. So I, I went and asked um, some, some guys in the class that, you know, knew a little bit about apps and this yeah. and that. And, um, from there, basically, originally, I was looking for a college student, you know, like in the computer science department to, mm-hmm. to partner with me and make this because, mm-hmm. you know, at the time I didn't have any money. I, mean, yeah. I still don't. But, yeah, yeah. you know, I didn't <laughs> yeah. I didn't know what the steps were to actually fund this kind of thing because mm-hmm. I didn't realize apps are so expensive. Apps, are they know, really? Oh, for a legit, you know, app, it's like what do you want to say 50, that 000. yours is not legit? What? <laughs> no, I mean, it's, you know, like if you go to like a, you know, a big company, yeah, big app yeah. development company, you know, they charge you upwards of 50,000 50, to develop an app and only for like you know a native app which is like a specifically iphone app or specifically android oh. it's expensive so where'd you go oh. the philippines <laughs> well i i that, like when i said outsourced you know originally i after the whole college thing didn't work after i looked everywhere i couldn't find anything um i went over to the computer and typed in you know uh india e- developer E-Lance. yeah yeah E-Lance, 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 you know, or like all those and uh I looked at the work, you know, I talked to many people like, you know, it's, it was a different experience for me because, you know, I've never dealt with that kind of thing, but they, you know, they, they speak pretty good English, you know, that's not the issue. Most of them. Yeah. Yeah. Most of them. But I think the biggest like uh, deal breaker for me was just the type of quality that they, Mm. that they did, you know, because it was like, it was fairly a decent price, you know, like a couple Mm -hmm. thousand dollars and they return it to you like in a couple of weeks, you know, the problem Mm -hmm. is they don't have our lifestyle and our mentality. So Mm -hmm. you have to explain it. I was involved with a couple overseas development. It's like you're talking and uh, left and they are answering on the East coast somewhere. <laughs> it's totally disconnected yeah. because yeah. they don't have the experience of our lifestyle. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, yeah. and not only that, it's just, you know, I, I wanted that, especially for something like this, that I, if I was going to jump into some kind of risk and spend thousands of dollars, like yeah. I wanted to mm-hmm. at least be close enough to somebody where I can, yes, you know, you can. talk face to face. <laughs> yeah. You know? yeah, exactly. And so Tell them this way, not this yeah, way. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. So did, you, did you contact one of the like nine year olds on YouTube? And develop apps? <laughs> Honestly, I mean, it's crazy how kids, you know, nowadays are like geniuses at this yeah. uh-huh. you know if, if i would have gotten into something when i was young it would have been coding you know i just yeah. didn't know of it when i was younger but mm-hmm. i've always been like kind of like a tech geek kind of like a you know computer whiz and 
um, you know, I, I still can't say I can code, but you know, I, I have a better understanding now than I did you yeah. know, before I started. So mm -hmm. yeah, no, long story short, I eventually found, you know, after searching the, you know, the whole planet, I eventually found somebody locally, you know, actually oh, here in Lake Forest. Nice. Nice. Oh, nice. Um, okay. So yeah. Reasonable. I, reasonable, you know, did some pretty big jobs. Um, they, was, the app looks nice. So. Yeah. I was willing yeah. to work with me since the beginning. You know, I told him I'm a broke college student, you yeah. know, did the whole, you know, typical mm -hmm. So story. how did yeah. you find it then? Uh, Hustling. Uh, hustling. Hustling. Does that mean oh, you boy. asked mom and dad? <laughs> uh, you know, I, everybody around. Of yeah. course, you know, I, I did. I asked my parents, yeah. I asked my grandparents, families, friends. Um, unfortunately, like my, my parents aren't in the best position to, you know, help me fund this kind of project. Especially when so. they have to pay your college bill. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 40000 a year. So, no. So, you know, I... I basically just had to start from the basics and, you know, family was the first place I could turn to, you know, absolutely. And, yeah. uh, just pit, you know, just pleaded my case, you know, like, this is what I'm trying to do. Like, believe in me, this and uh -huh. that. And, please, um, please, please, please help me. <laughs> um, yeah. So it was, it was tough, you know, at, at some points, like I honestly didn't know how I was going to come up with the next payment and this and that mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. turn to bank loans, everything mm -hmm. like just, did you take bank loans? Get re got rejected. Did, you got of course rejected. you did. You're a college That's student. Rejected. <laughs> yeah. No you know? income. Yeah. No income. I mean, you know, I not I, yet, but you know what? You can go back when this is huge. Yeah. And buy the bank. And, the bank. <laughs> and fire the guy and, who didn't give and me the give loan. Give him. Yeah. Decline him on exactly. the loan. No, so, you know, and I, and I tried giving him the same smeal. You know, like I'm a broke college student. They, they didn't care. Oh, well, as soon as no. you say that, they're like, oh, yeah. never mind. <laughs> <laughs> the rest of the conversation yeah. is useless. No, yeah. so it was a, it was a huge learning experience, and yeah. um, you know, ultimately, you know, at, at the end, we finally got some of my my closer friends who graduated, um, and we ended up finishing the 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 investment um, of it. Mm -hmm. So we we got the full full amount. And, oh, nice. Uh, so what's the total cost so far? You're out of pocket. Oh, uh, lots of money. Let's yeah, <laughs> let's say yeah, let's say a lot of money. Okay. Yeah. So let's put it another way. How many apps do you? Well, apps are free, so. Mm -hmm. You are going to make money on the residual from the mm -hmm. from yeah. the people, which is the way to do it. I mean, yeah. there's plenty of all the games now are free. Everything, is and free. then you just they get you with. Well, well my base isn't building fast that, enough. <laughs> I mean, yeah, those the way those work though is like they make majority of their money through ad revenue. Mm -hmm. You know, because oh. that's and yours is ad free, ad free. Yeah. You know, so for an app that has no ads and also is free, like you know, you'd you'd imagine like, mm -hmm. oh, this app's not making any money, but yeah. You know, that's that's the tricky part about it is kind of, you know, formulating a new idea that, mm -hmm. you know, isn't being done because yeah. you know, anybody can throw ads on something. And yeah. it just, you know, I, I get tired of seeing like the new mm -hmm. like hair trimmer you know, <laughs> yeah. ad at the bottom. Like, the yeah. And, yeah. yeah and, and it just, you know, it doesn't it makes your app look cluttered and it just yeah. gets it. Uh, makes you it know. seem cheap. Yeah, exactly. Makes it seem cheap. I like the fact that you're you're I mean, because that's a that's another risk you're taking with the app, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, is, is risking the whole stick of the app on and whether people use it or not. Yeah. Yes. And if they use it, whether they actually pay, yeah, they pay or not. I mean, how do you enforce, uh, when, if I have the app and we are living together enforce that I will pay, yes. how do you do that? Well, if, so like you were mentioning earlier, um, you enter your credit card info. Okay. Um, and so all that's secure. We don't hold anybody's credit card information, okay. you know, with all that whole data breaches. Yeah, and yeah. Stuff. We don't hold anybody's information on somebody on else. will. <laughs> Well, somewhere else we use uh we use uh one of the most protected servers and that's paypal uh-huh so oh, okay, your money's nice. secured through paypal we don't we don't hold anybody's okay. credit card info well then you have to pay paypal yeah yeah we do so we we take that out of our 20 percent fee oh okay yeah it's our service fee you know so we have to pay our e-commerce we have to pay you know all yeah. these different things and how uh, paypal charges a lot like uh what is it uh, uh well on normally they charge uh 30 cents plus uh 30 percent Okay. Something like that, yeah. And uh, with the way our thing was set up, we we worked. Well, we didn't work a deal, but you know, we we talked to PayPal, and <laughs> we. I, I want to make it sound all cool. We yeah. we found a different pricing structure. Yeah. Um, okay. And and yeah, it's listen uh, to this kid. Student pricing. Quote. Pricing <laughs> structures <laughs> <Okay>. and <laughs> hustling. Of course. This is a. You know what? My generation really got screwed with our <laughs> our drive and passion. This new generation is awesome, man. So. Um, so it sounds like everything's going well, but the thing that we've all been asking and I even wondered about was how do you, if I don't do my chores, mm -hmm. how do you enforce that I'm paying? So, yeah, so you, um, at the end of the, at the end of the week, you know, yeah. when you finish your chore, what you do is you go into the app and you'll select, uh, John just finished his chore, whatever. Um, it'll send a push notification to your roommates saying, you know, John just finished the chore, go verify. Um, They'll go in, they'll click on the thing, and then they'll go, you know, like say they'll pass by the they'll kitchen. They'll go look. Yeah, they'll go look, whatever. Ah, it's clean. So they go in, check it off, Yeah. and you're good. So once you have all your checks for the week, then you're good. Is there an so, extra fee if the card is declined? 
<laughs> well, <laughs> they yeah, should be. Yeah, um, <laughs> it, it'll it'll get hold up. Like their their funds will get uh, will get held up. Oh. So their their reward money. Um, <laughs> and yeah, and, and also you have to take a mandatory photo. So there's no like, and it'll get time stamped. So there's no like, oh, you know, I took or I did my chore, but you know, you guys. So you complete the chore, take a photo. Take a photo before you like officially. To verify. Yeah, to verify. So half ass work will not go through. Basically, Very the nice. the logic behind it was looking at. Looking through the eyes of a lazy person. Yeah, you know? <laughs> I like that. I could, I could, I can contest that. You, you can, know, I, you I said, what would I do? You yeah, know, exactly. And just went from there. You so know? let me ask you a question: If you were chore to pick up the laundry and take them to whatever, and you push them under the, 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 the bed and put the nice cover on it. <laughs> Yeah, it but if your roommates go check. Yeah, but if yeah. you took a picture, oh. Yeah, look, but if your roommates cool. are smart, yeah. which it sounds like he is, they're going to walk by <laughs> and double check. All yeah. right. It yeah. just sounds, you know, it sounds like the military with, but now you got an app to help back you up. Yeah. yeah right. And I mean, you you have a household admin, so that'll kind of. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So the, so yeah. the person yeah. who. Police. Yeah, exactly. Uh, the person who downloads and sets up the house first is uh -huh. the automatic okay, default the, admin. So he'll, he'll, or he'll, he or she will uh, be able to go in and, you know, say if any, there's any discrepancies, like say somebody did do the chore, but they got wrongfully charged. Yeah, yeah. yeah. About yeah. 24 hours after the chore week. Like a, a chore commissioner. Yeah, yeah sure. very nice. And does he get a little bit better cut? Uh, no, from the rest of oh, the no. <laughs> more work, less more pay, work, yeah. no. same okay. pay. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, Jonathan Avalos has been with us talking about his Check It app. Uh, Jonathan, we're going to move on to a couple of our segments we need to knock out before the next commercial break. Yeah, yeah. it's been. If you want to know about his app, go download yeah. it. And, and it shows it, that with uh, good vision and good uh, yeah. belief, you can accomplish and climb the mountains. Yeah, check so it. we're gonna yeah. we're gonna get into our tech talk segment real quick avi uh, what have you got on the board for us today okay well the first we i read uh, last week that google glass you mm -hmm. know the new glass they came mm -hmm. up with that uh, the, uh, some researchers uh, found that they will give you a blind spot first so it blocks some of the vision but not only that supposedly after a while you were your eye for some reason stop it uh, start getting spots in it Whoa. from the google glass so uh, they said it might be a manufacturer defect that maybe raise the glass up but then you can't see mm -hmm. the glass so they said the the part of the glass where it covers is not good for you and some people maybe got into accidents yeah. because they couldn't see the peripheral vision. well when they perfect it you're going to put your app <laughs> that's it <laughs> on google some, glass yeah, just literally verify <laughs> yeah, your exactly eyes. Yeah. The other thing, Jawbone comes up, uh, coming up with a new uh, band. The one that you have like forty of. I have <laughs> the first one. I had over f literally over twenty five or thirty. Wow! Because uh, they were defective. Literally, it works for two days. You charge it and it's dead. Well, that's how you so make they money. kept re well, they <laughs> kept replacing it for no. free. So for a year and a half, I got free apps and uh, free bands. Then they upgraded it, and the new one it took three of them. But I will be a little careful with the app three, uh, the up three because they're supposedly track your heart rate and wow. your uh, sleep and your diet. So so they're catching up to what everyone else. Yeah, everybody, yeah, yeah, everybody going in the same direction. And the last thing is uh, Microsoft is going into the watch as well. Oh, yeah. God. <laughs> I'm are, enough is enough. They are chasing after Samsung and Apple with their yeah. watch, and their watch will be available before the holidays. And so. I'm sure it'll be susceptible to lots of viruses, too. And, Probably. And you have to reboot it every three days. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Well, yeah. that is a lot to chew on. Uh, we got to go to commercial break soon. But All I right. do want to bring one thing up before we go. Our contest for the... I can fly X3. Oh, wow. Three axis gimbal for your iPhone. This thing is awesome. We had it on two shows ago. We actually filmed while we were doing the show. Check it out. Are you going to try it again and in front of the camera to show so they can go up and ah, like us? And I don't know if they. I don't know if they deserve it. Oh, okay. Because we already did it once, and they need to sign up. Yeah, tweet. Yeah, log, the, the contest the is still likes. going. This thing is awesome. We have them to give away. I can't supplying them. Actually, they actually, they are very uh, hard to get because they are sold out of mm -hmm. 2015. Oh, wow. So we have the only one here. Yeah, we have one right here. But I'm telling you, we're going to select winners, and you guys are going to miss out. Yep. Plain and simple. So, Jonathan, tell all your people you enter. Your yeah. friends, your this school. This thing is awesome. It's yeah. you, we, you know what a gimbal is, right? You know yeah. how it works. So just yeah. keep your it's phone or GoPro accesses. flat. And it just, yeah. yeah. I mean, you have to practice a little bit because you still have to be smooth. You can't just jerk it around and stuff. But... This thing is awesome. It's all made out of metal, rechargeable batteries. It's awesome. So uh, 
We'll come be back with Jonathan Avalos after the break. Check it. <laughs> 